the great molasses, flood, a sticky situation. In the bustling city of Boston, on January 15, 1919, tragedy struck in the most unexpected and surreal manner. The Great Molasses Flood, also known as the Boston Molasses Disaster, remains one of the most bizarre and devastating incidents in American history. In the early afternoon, residents of the North End neighborhood were going about their daily routines when suddenly, without warning, a massive wave of molasses came crashing through the streets. The thick, sticky substance surged through the narrow alleyways and crowded thoroughfares, engulfing everything in its path. The cause of the flood was a 50-foot tall tank owned by the Purity Distilling Company, which had been filled with over two million gallons of molasses. Due to a combination of factors, including unseasonably warm temperatures, structural weaknesses, and poor maintenance, the tank ruptured, unleashing a torrent of molasses at speeds of up to 35 miles per hour. The force of the wave was unimaginable. Buildings were ripped from their foundations, vehicles were overturned, and people were swept off their feet and carried along by the relentless tide of molasses. The air was filled with screams of terror and cries for help as the city was plunged into chaos. In the aftermath of the disaster, the streets of Boston resembled a scene from a nightmare. Survivors struggled to free themselves from the sticky quagmire, while rescue workers raced against time to pull victims from the wreckage. The sweet smell of molasses hung heavy in the air, mingling with the stench of death and destruction. The human toll was staggering. Twenty-one people lost their lives in the flood, and over 150 others were injured. The victims included men, women, and children, whose lives were cut short in a matter of seconds by the sheer force of nature's fury. But the tragedy did not end there. In the days and weeks that followed, the city of Boston was left to grapple with the aftermath of the disaster. Streets and buildings were coated in a thick layer of molasses, making rescue and recovery efforts even more challenging. The cleanup process was slow and arduous, with workers laboring tirelessly to remove the sticky residue from every surface. The Great Molasses Flood left an indelible mark on the city of Boston and its residents. It exposed the dangers of industrial negligence and served as a stark reminder of the fragility of human life in the face of unchecked corporate greed. In the years since, the memory of the disaster has faded, but its legacy lives on as a cautionary tale of the consequences of hubris and indifference. Today, the site of the Great Molasses Flood is marked by a simple plaque, a solemn reminder of the lives lost and the lessons learned from one of the most bizarre and tragic events in American history. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.